Hello everyone, welcome back. We have another versus match. It's against my friend. We're gonna keep the weapon. We're gonna get rid of that. Let's get rid of the mine, even though he'd be useful against uh anyways, let's get rid of that. Uh this is a Norath. I believe that's how you pronounce it. Uh Death Rattle Paladin deck. I'm really looking forward to. This is the first time I'm actually playing it. Uh so let's see if I could do really good and get a win. Uh, hello, challenger. Um Okay, so we don't have much. That's really bad. It's a very, very powerful deck. Um, a lot of people like it. And I also have one for the Druid, one for the Priest. And it's pretty interesting. So I'm going to be showcasing this Noroth um, guy's uh, decks very soon. This is a Versus, so it's not on the ladder. But uh, let's see if I could get a... I believe he's using a Wild deck that's... That deals with Malagos, so it's going to be really tough. Luckily, uh, Paladin has a lot of ways of getting rid of stuff. Okay, so, um... The battle. Let's do that, and let, since we don't really have anything to play, let's the just put this. It may have buy us a turn. This guy is a pretty nice uh, addition to the deck because he's so good about aggro and all that good stuff. Okay, so we're starting to get stuff. We don't really have anything, so uh, I don't know if he... I think he does have a... a... Um, a... Uh, ooh, so I'm not going to play that. And then we're just going to do that. And then whatever he drops down, we could turn five. You know, it's not good going this many turns without anything, but he hasn't put anything really on the board. So... All right, we're definitely not going to be doing that. So what we're going to do is bait out. Ooh, this is kind of bad, bad because this is a really bad counter to uh to um um. Uh, was I going to say a real bad counter to uh this deck's hexes? Hexes really ruined the day. All right, so. We need to get something on the ground, so we're going to do this. No time for games. Unfortunately, we don't have anything to um, the battle. negate that high uh, attack. And after I'm done, I'll showcase the deck. Mine, I changed a little bit based on some guys' comments on the thread, so it's a little bit different. And uh, we'll see. i got to start... Uh, well, he has so many cards. Yes, he has to have Hex. I really don't think I can get much value out of this with him because he's not... I don't think his deck's very minion-based. Uh, oh. Good thing is, um, that's not going to affect the death rattle portion of it. So... I'm going to play uh, the Stampeding uh, Kodo anyways, even though he doesn't really have anything. I'll kill the Healing Totem and so it could kill his, uh... His other one. Alright, so... Let none survive! Alright, so I'm establishing a board. I hope I can get rid of... Uh, well, I have a lot of cards, so that's good. He's probably going to hex Tyrion. It's going to be really devastating. I'm going to see if we could... Um... Alright, so he's setting up for something, so that's not good. Let's go ahead and... Let none survive. We're not going to play Tyrion just yet. None We're going to see if we can bait spells. out... Uh... Alright, so I'm back up to a decent amount of health in case he has Malagos. And if he does, I have answer for that. I really did hope he... he has to have Hex, so... Elemental Destruction. Okay, so Overload's gonna be bad. Um, but he probably has a... Uh, okay, so next turn... Man, I'm gonna hate losing Tyrion. He's a really big part of the combo. All right, so let's see what he does. So his deck's not really minion based, and uh, let's do this. Put your faith in the light. Greetings, friend. And then I know exactly Sir. what's gonna come next. Ah. 
Uh, hex, but I can't just let him sit there. Unfortunately, that's part of the combo. I haven't got the other death rattle cards like uh, blood hoof and some other stuff, but it is what it is. He has that. All right, so yeah, my draw has been pretty bad. I mean, look at this. There's nothing really good. Okay, that we gotta get rid of. All right, so let's do this. Let's do this. Do that to get rid of him. Also get some card draw. I don't know. We're not going to heal just yet. Uh, but, um, man, I cannot believe I'm getting none of the components of the deck that makes it so awesome. And he's just getting all this time... Even though, like I said, Malagos will be dealt with and I have a lot of healing, but still. You know, it's dangerous. They do a shitload of bursts than, than that guy, right? So, we gotta get rid of him. He's probably gonna do some area effect to get a lot of healing. Um, let's see what he does. I'm gonna probably have to use that next. Um... Yeah, at least I get a card draw. Yeah, I have no answer for this guy yet. Alright, good. Yeah, look at that. This guy with the right setup is pretty brutal. Okay, so we're going to have to clear out this board. So much for... Um, You know what? I'm gonna put that down there. Just in case he's by me another turn. Because I'm kinda low on health. He could burst me down really easy. That way he can't he won't put Malagos down unless he plans on hexing it or oh he could silence it, but we'll see. So let's see what he does. Uh anyways, I'm gonna have to use the lay of hands next to get some card draw. What is he gonna oh rock. oh healing weight damn it. Hmm. Interesting they didn't show his death. Alright, so that's good. Alright, here we go, here we go. <laughs> Hex two. But at least he's not part of the combo, so that's good, and I get back to full heal. What a great card, by the way. You know, if you guys re remember from the unpacking the day or two ago, uh, I got him. I was going to craft the golden one, but since I got the normal, there's no no real reason. Nathod, uh, Nath Zod, uh, I crafted gold, so if you get to see him in this game, it's going to be pretty awesome. Uh, another component. So, actually, it's amazing to see this guy getting good play, so... Okay, I'm glad I'm within probably safe healing. He should have another Hex, I would assume. But I think he's planning on saving it because he probably figured out what kind of deck I am. Maybe, maybe not. Alright, that thing's got to go. I'm actually tempted to use the Lay of Hands on it. Because I don't want it to die. Wow, all that draw and he doesn't have... Little time. Wow, this is a long game, guys. But it's... So far, good. A little slower than most, I suppose, especially compared to the Tempo Mage. But, um, and then Shaman, I got a lot of stuff, too. Oh, okay. So he's going to take 8 damage. All right. At least it's better than, um... All right, so let's get some stuff on the board here. He's pr you know, uh, here he is, and look how m beautiful that is. I had to craft it. Look at the waves, look at everything. Okay, I'm not going to put him just yet. Um... I'm going to... Oh, uh, he's probably going to hex that. Or has he used two hexes? I can't remember. I really should actually have gotten rid of that, but I'm not going to use all this. Okay, yeah. Good thing I waited. I'm going to take good care of that in a minute. He's setting up his combo. 
All right, so. Do you like to play with fire? One thing I wanted him to die, that's why I didn't do the other combo, the Consecration, because next turn, I have a big surprise, assuming I don't die. So yeah, I could have technically kept my board intact, but uh, I wanted uh, Bloodhoof to die, so that way I get uh, full or more value from Narath here. Like I said, I had to craft that in the Druid uh, Legendary. They're both so awesome, Golden. All right, so that's okay. Okay, he does Healing Wave. I wonder why it, it must be a bug in Versus. Anyways, let's put out this bad boy and see what happens if I could live long enough. Unfortunately, I don't have a way to deal with uh, Malagos. So I didn't get all the components, but uh, at least I got something. Um, normally, you could fill this up with a huge amount. I have a Infested Terran. I have a few more Death Rattle cards in here, but unfortunately, uh, this is the only two I got so far. So I can't just sit there and do nothing. Well, actually, I could have waited one more turn and done that, but nah. hmm. Oh, here we go. Hex, maybe? What is it? Which one? And one thing I love about crafting the gold, you get the golden versions of the cards that died, even though I don't have the golden, so that's kind of nice. Okay. Oh, here comes Malagos. Yeah. And here goes a shitload of uh, damage, but if I survive, I have a lot of healing. And am I going to survive? Oh, shit. Ah, oh, you got to be kidding. Anyways, I can never beat this guy. Um, it it doesn't matter if I would have waited one more turn or not, maybe. Uh, but he had the combo set up, and I can see why he's having a good time on ladder. Anyways, uh, let's go over the deck. And I'll have a link in there uh, for it. Uh, where is he? So, we have two Forbidden Heals, two Equalities, one Ooze, which I never got while I had the Doom Hammer. Two Doomsayers, Wild Pyromancer, Pain for card draw. These guys never came out. Mind Tech for flooding the board. Two uh, Champions. I only have one I once he levels up a little bit more. And then uh, we have Consecration, Udaman, uh, Tank, card draw. This I wish I would have gotten. And then uh, you have some more. Um, he unfortunately hexed it. But even that, it still wouldn't have mattered. Anyways, guys. Um... I hope you enjoy it, and there'll be more. This will be actually on the ladder next time I feature this deck, but I hope you enjoyed it. And again, I cannot beat this guy. He's always getting me, but at least the games are fun. Okay.